then some very bad thing happens with the person. It is a really tough job. Yes, your example must be good and it is there. We, we can say almost 90% of the country, journalists are good relationship with the people, the concerned, the newspapers, the society, the government, and all the people. But it is still there in certain places where the rude behaviors have been done, a lot of known things which are required not to be done are being done with those people. So those things require to be taken care of. We are not asking that uh, your point is perfectly right. It is in Belgium, the world relations are there. It is good. It is good. We need to make it more, more better. Right. So it is always better that we should try to do more better. I, I think, I think uh, Philip's provocation in a way is interesting because he's also hinting at the fact that the more I as an individual find interesting content elsewhere, the worse the problem of the media industry will become because I'm going to move my attention to some other place and that's deadly for your business model because, you know, and in fact, we have seen social networks like Google uh, and, and, and Facebook are now putting in place mechanisms to avoid the, the, you know, the latest Google algorithm, for example, punishes um, clickbait and so it downgrades them. Uh, uh, Facebook is introducing a, 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 a system whereby it can say, if I think a store is bunk, I can say hey, this is this is a lie. So it seems to me that social networks are working to improve the quality of what they put out, because at the end of the day, the competition is for attention of people. But do we need a set of best, best practices? Because you know, you guys in the media industry have codified. Um,